yeah morning guys uh, welcome to my youtube channel at uh, fellow the boy so guys please for the returning subscribers thank you for watching thank you for returning for the those one who are watching for the first time please consider by subscribing to my youtube channel at uh, fellow the boy it is a bright morning here i'm preparing now i have carried them uh, okay there is a shoes here let me do like this to remove dust then i wear it is cold so today i won't wear the open shoes i know i love open shoes but uh, because of the cold uh, i can feel some cold and i'm going to the mot motorbike i have to put on shoes uh. yeah we have a lot of dust right now it has not been raining for so long so i have to close house uh. Guys, if I lost my key, you tell me I kept it. If I forgot where I kept my key, you tell me, guys. Oh. I normally use this one to, to bed, to take shower. This one is a good one. You do like this when you are getting shower. You remove all sweat. It is from a sack. I will have to hang it here. So that it can't drop again okay i'm now leaving so otenga has already left to go to to the site and uh, with me i was uh, working on some budget here so i delayed i delayed a bit i had to finish first so that i can be able to go wow my guardian's house here These are the trees huh? that they have already started dry because very soon I will be burning bricks. That one also. This one that was cut here, it was almost to drop or uh, uh, to even to destroy this house. But uh, it, it also destroyed our borehole a bit. Yesterday we paid those one who was complaining that uh, they need to be paid. We have paid them guys. Yeah, this is our cow. It is chewing a gum here. You can look. It wants to eat. Hi, say hi. Say hi. Hi. Yeah, it has said hi. It has greeted you. I have now enough firewood to burn my bricks. Enough firewood. You can look at it. This one will be, uh, will be able to burn the bricks. Look at it, guys. It is drying now. It is so cold. It is too cold, I mean. You can hear from the... You can hear from the blowing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, thank God for those one who... Uh, who gave me some advice about uh, uh, the cones the cones that uh, uh, were destroyed by my tree the tree that uh, was being cut and yesterday uh, I went we went and uh, uh, discussed about the issue so I went and uh, uh, looked for the woman because uh, she had called me me I thought that uh, uh, it will be maybe a police case uh? But uh, she called me and she said that, uh, fellow the boy, uh, you are my neighbor. And uh, you have ignored me for so long because I'm a widow. To an extent that uh, you take an opportunity, you take, uh, you just decide to destroy uh, my, my cons. And when you destroyed my cons, you never came to me to ask for forgiveness. Then I told her that, uh, I didn't know that uh, their cones has been destroyed eh? because uh, that day they fall the tree that tree remained there they had to remove some logs but uh, the others the other trees remains there and uh, I was not around I never visited that place 
I never visited that place. My my young brother uh, was yeah, was in charge of uh, of that uh, all cutting of the trees because I had assigned him. Since I was somehow busy, in fact, even paying those people who are uh, who are falling the trees, I just sent this money to my young brother to give them, and he did so. Only to come and realize that uh, yesterday, previously, so I told her that previous, previously is the day that I had this story. And uh, she just took it, she never even understood it, but uh, uh, what I asked her, I told her that uh, it has already been happened and it was accidentally, it was not my fault, I didn't know that it will be that way. So tell me what do you want? Then she said that, oh, you know, uh, uh, I, I don't want to be paid, you know, these issues of being pay, uh, of paying is not good and that maze uh, we were we were two of them in that maze i was not alone i was not alone uh, it was a collabo it was a collabo uh, plantation yeah so they collaborated with a certain boy there not a boy but a guy yeah? just a man okay so i told her uh, now what we do uh, just call that uh, just call that guy so that he can come uh, i hear also from him you see yeah i hear also from from that guy because because i told uh, because i told her that uh, i know uh, you want to be paid i've already destroyed uh, uh, your concert has already been uh, destroyed by my tree so i'm like the one who has did it yeah? now she said that you, this uh, this case is, go, um, is going now. I'm forwarding it to uh, that guy whom we did with it with him, a collabo. So it's like they had already discussed about it. Yeah, they had already discussed about it. Yeah, coffee. That. Yeah. So yeah, they had already discussed about it. So what I did, uh, I just uh, I asked her to give me the number. Of the guy who he said that she said that uh, uh, they planted with him maize and uh, when I called this guy uh, this guy is the one who came and said that uh, uh, this maize uh, belong to all of us so what you are going to do you are going to pay uh, 11,000 shillings so I asked him uh, okay uh, I asked him how many cones were destroyed he said 11 they, it was 11 the way we had also uh, counted me and Otenga, they were 11 so he said that uh, he want to be paid uh, 11,000 shillings so each 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 coin to be 1,000 shillings then I was like oh okay you want to be paid yes let me go and withdraw the money so Zach Discovery has an M-Pesa I went uh, I called Zach I went and told Zach that uh, uh, you know the story that I was told you that uh, uh, I, my tree uh, fall on the somebody's cones. Uh, those cones, uh, the owner, I say that I pay him eleven thousand shillings. That is that. Okay, say that that is according to agriculture agricultural uh, law. So that that came and asked him, which agriculture law says that you are supposed to pay one thousand shillings per corn? Yeah. Yeah. yeah so uh, what i'm saying is that uh, so zach came and uh, asked this uh, this guy that uh, uh, which rule uh, of agriculture that says that uh, to uh, amaze one corn is supposed to be uh, 1000 shillings so this guy was like oh uh, so okay look me uh, look look how you can look the man that you will give, be able to give me uh, now me uh, uh, I don't know what, what, what you will do as long as you pay me because uh, uh, you people you have ignored my land for long. Then uh, Zach told uh, him that uh, the agriculture rule you are supposed to you are supposed to pay they pay 200 shillings per one corn. And you see this guy had lied to me that uh, it is uh, 1000 shillings. So I was almost to give him 11,000 shillings. You see? Because uh, if it is for to, uh, uh, if somebody needs to be paid, let him be paid. But uh, he has to remember that uh, also he's a human being and he's staying in this world. Huh? So the money he reduced the money uh, up to three hundred per corn now. 
So we can clear it 300 uh, by uh, by 11. We got it 3,300 shillings. So I paid him 3,300 shillings and he went. So he was like, oh, Zach, uh, who are you? You are now, uh, 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 this, this was between me and fellow. You are now uh, getting inside and you don't know, uh, uh, you, you don't know uh, how this case is. But Zach told him that fellow is my friend and is my brother. So I can't let anyone uh, to come and uh, uh, come here and pretend that uh, uh, he's a, uh, you, 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 now we know that fellow is a YouTuber. You are coming to tell him that to give you 11,000 shillings. I remember before that they had said that, oh, these guys of YouTube, they see that they have money, so they are doing what they can do. They, they are ignoring, ignoring other people. So that's how it went, and uh, uh, we finished very well. We thank God for everything, and uh, we are free now to work. And uh, even right now, I want to go at uh, Kibranga to go and confirm some work there. Then from there, I'm supposed today to go at, uh, uh, at Mama Maria. So guys, uh, there is something I want to share with you. And uh, I want to hear uh, from you also. I am going at Mama Maria first to confirm, to do some inquiry about her land. I'm not sure. I'm not sure enough if that land uh, is already documented. For example, it has the documents that belongs to her or not. Because uh, as we are speaking, one of the subscribers uh, had already sent, she has already sent money, $200 for the toilet. Yeah. So she said that uh, she's sending $200 We start the project of the toilet. Then, uh, 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 meanwhile, uh, the, the project will be going on. Uh, some subscribers who are willing to help Mama Maria, because we have some of the ladies who are saying that oh, Mama Maria needs help, we need to help her. So we will start that project and uh, uh, they will chip in now uh, so that we can be able now to continue with uh, uh, the project at Mama Maria. But first, uh, I will be heading there uh, to go and first confirm if uh, the land belongs to her completely. You know, the case like Mama Fred, uh, it was confirmed first. You remember when we went there, when we, we wanted to start a project there, we went and asked for the grandfather. We asked the grandfather uh, to help us uh, by, to help us with, uh, uh, to give us permission. Not the grand, but the father-in-law. I mean, the father-in-law, I'm sorry. So the father-in-law gave us permission uh, to do uh, their uh, project. So even at Mama Maria, we have also to go and uh, look for, uh, because I heard that that land belongs to uh, Baba Charles. Charles is the, uh, that guy who has a problem with the legs, the limb. So we have to go and find out uh, uh, more. We are supposed to go and do some inquiry uh, to go and uh, uh, find if uh, the land belongs to Mama Maria or the land does not belong to Mama Maria. Because uh, we don't want to start a project, then later we come to find that uh, uh, we have intruded in somebody's land. Or you find that uh, maybe Mama Maria was given just a place to stay. And uh, you find that maybe uh, the project that we have done has gone missing. So that's our work that we are going to do today and we shall be uh, getting to you to tell you how it has gone. So that one will be after I have moved from Kengaris, from Kibranga, uh, then I will have to go and uh, visit that place so that uh, we can see on how we can help each other. But thank you very much for the lady who gave out uh, uh, that money, uh, 27,000 to start. Uh, so $200 is equivalent to 27,000 Kenyan shillings. So uh, whoever did this, we really say we appreciate for that and uh, God bless you. And uh, also uh, yesterday uh, I was at Mama Joel and uh, I was not uh, be able to meet Joel since uh, it was so ev it was in the evening and I came it was late uh, so I was not be, be able to go there to meet him but I will try my best to make sure that I find him it will be so good and uh, there is also one of the subscriber uh, who sent me some money to go uh, to give uh, uh, I'm supposed to give uh, 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 Otenga Junior. Yeah, I'm supposed to give Otenga Jr. Uh, for, for the praying lady and the, uh, the other money for Otenga Jr.'s project. Otenga Jr.'s project and uh, the other one for Otenga. So I'm going there to the site uh, to go and confirm how uh, that money uh, uh, I'll read because I don't have the phone here. When I reach there, I will be able to confirm and uh, see how I'm supposed to distribute it. So, but uh, after a while, we shall be going there at Kengariso, me and Zach. 
because Zach has also a task there he is supposed to do. We are supposed to be giving you today's budge, uh, a budget towards Mama Fred's uh, project. Uh, remember we have been working on it uh, since we completed that uh, project and that's why we have taken long a bit. Uh, so we will make sure that uh, uh, today we are uh, trying our best to give out uh, the budget towards Mama Fred's project. Uh, the budget that we are going to read for you uh, today, it will be for uh, construction of the house. After that construction of the house, we shall be having a, uh, a budget for whatever was bought inside the house. Anything that was bought in that compound, be, be it goats, uh, hens, uh, the chairs, uh, the coaches, uh, the TV, the brackets, uh, the beds, the duvets, everything. That one you shall be able to watch at Zach Discovery's video because Zach Discovery's will be working on the budget of uh, everything uh, that was bought in that house. Me, I will be working on the budget of the uh, everything that was uh, used on the construction of Mama Fred's uh, house. So I'm with Zach Discovery's here before I head to Kibranga. Uh, he has come here, he, has at, uh, he was at Mama Felista's, you will be able to watch in the video. Uh, what uh, he was talking about, but uh, let me at least uh, uh, greet him and hear from him. Yeah, so good morning, good morning, good morning, our wonderful subscribers. Yeah, yeah you're checking what it's morning. Yeah, I'm checking. <laughs> it's still morning. It's still morning. So it's a good day yeah. that uh, I'm at Fellow the Boys' place. Yeah, this is, you remember this house? Eh? Yeah. This is Fellow the Boys' garden's house. This is, yeah, this is the yeah, and this is the plan we used at Mama Felicia's Mama yeah. Fer Fred's Mama place. Fred's place. Yes, so Mama Felicia's name has come into the mouth because I was at her place today. Ah. So I was passing there and I noted that we have quite new structures constructed there. Yes. So I peeped in, I wanted to know how. So we talked, we laughed. You know that lady, she's very happy whenever she's there. That's true. That's so true. I happened now to share a little bit with her. Yeah. Uh, so I happened to capture a little bit of it. You'll check it in my video yeah. because I noted some things there that uh, I wanted to inquire what really happened. Yeah. Yeah. This time that we were working at Mama Fred's house, uh, quite a lot has happened to that lady. Yeah. So that, uh, but we thank God, thank God that she managed to go through them. Yes. You'll check what happened yeah. and how she's uh, faring now on. Yeah. So she's a charming lady. That was the second project for fellow the boy. The second project. The second project. The third at Mama Fred, the fourth at the one she is having. Yeah. So that lady, you need to know. For those people in this video and you have not seen uh, this channel and you have not known who Mama Felisa is, yeah. please check her out. She's a very wonderful young lady. And hard working. And hard, hard work. Hard work. In fact, she what, he, what she was even doing when I was just uh, take, talking to her, yeah. just uh, you just feel happy. You know, there's someone that you'll help and just keep on uh, yeah. uh, uh, whatever she does from that yes. will give you a moral Mot yeah, yeah, motivation yeah, yeah. you see yeah. what she was even doing what she has been doing even the the children themselves they are very very decent and <clears throat> very decent and yeah. very creative yeah. yeah i'll show you what the boy did yeah. oh. check that in my video <laughs> Hey, After yeah, Pamela left, Manu. Ma not Manu, yeah. Elijah. Oh, Elijah, yeah, yeah. There's something he did that is very lovely. But today yeah. they were not in school, or oh, they're in after. They're, they're in school. They're here. Oh, what, what or something he did? he did there before. So, oh, before. So, yeah, something oh, that. Oh, so there is something that he did there. Yes, that inspired so you. I right? captured and I yeah. liked it. Yeah. So, if you're on this channel for the first time and you have not subscribed to Fellow the Boy, yeah. please consider by subscribing. We are pushing our boss to ten thousand subscribers plus, yes. yeah. and Otenga Junior, don't forget him. Mine is Act Discoveries. Don't forget to meet fellow them. By the way, Instagram is easy, but they have come to love the Instagram. Yeah. More than even was up. Yeah, it has uh, so many followers. Yeah. Every day you visit, you find somebody trying to follow you. Imagine. For the good work that you are doing. Yeah. Yeah. So please consider. Thank you so much for watching our videos. The big support you people are giving to us. Watching our video without skipping the ads. You like, you comment, you even share. May God bless you. May God give you good health. May God keep you strong every day. Yeah. Much love from Zach Discoveries. Baby. Yeah. So, me and Zach Discovery, we shall be uh, getting mm -hmm. to Kangari. So yes. We have a budget that will be, as I told you. Mm -hmm. Also, we are supposed to visit Mama Maria. Yeah. So, thank you very much. Let us meet there. Thank you. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, so the work is still going on at here at uh, Kubranga. And uh, what uh, is happening right now is the uh, I told you she'll be having another stone, so this house uh, is going to take a lot of stones. <laughs>
because of the deep the deep some places are deep so we have to use stones before we put a, 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 a flow we want a very strong flow a flow that uh, is uh, a strong one yeah so what you are seeing right now they want to, uh, to put down the materials and i will be showing you uh, also the progress it is good also guys to see the work that i'm doing some people are asking me that uh, why is it that you are showing us somebody's project okay they say that you have to show us but uh, you have not to explain more about it this is the content <laughs> this is content somebody would like to watch how, how the work is going on in africa how some works are being done you see somebody is recording down how he can spend when he wants to build a house like this one so many people are following us huh? so that's why i i asked sir edward to be taking here videos and making content yeah for the good work that I, i'm doing here So it is lunch time, people have break for lunch and uh, uh, we have here in a case... Nani fundi? Saidia wifu tiyako tupimieksim? Oh, 15? 16 feet, stand up. So we are confirming the feet of the borehole because they haven't yet hit the water. But uh, I think... They are still going on because if you see here we have it is the they have reached at a, a very hard place. According to how they are saying that the hard place is the whereby we normally have the hops. That's sixteen. Mm -hmm. Sixteen foot. The last is equal for fifteen. So, uh, and as, like I said, I said that uh, because it is a hard place, they requested that they be paid uh, uh, 1,000 per feet. So, what what we are experiencing here is what is inside this uh, this borehole, and the other one are also here. As a high end, we are going to. Okay. So you, uh, you want again to blast it. Mm -hmm. So uh, last time he had uh, uh, blasted it, uh, it was uh, two times. So you know when you blast it, there is a different amount. It is 6,000 shillings per blasting. Yeah, 6,000 shillings per blasting. And uh, they blasted two times. So right now they want again to do blasting, the third one. The third one they want uh, to do it so that uh, we can. Uh, uh, they, they are saying that uh, the third one they will. Uh, they, are, they have hopes that they will find water. That's why they are trying to. You are going to pick it up in the amusho. Yes, we pick up mara mara big amusho. The amusho. Okay, so maybe okay. I will send you money. Tapu tumia kwa simu. Eh, nikisha nda ibinata kani nda. Labda kufikia sa nasiju tafadhi zovit sa. Nungbali gani pini nenda kufadhi? Yeah, so that's what uh, has happened today. And uh, we have also the construction of the train that is going on here. And you see very well, we have the, I told you yesterday that uh, we shall be having the plastering of the trench, the foundation I mean. 
at least uh, to cover the the mats that they used to construct uh, the foundation so that uh, when it rains it cannot be affected and they are using the conch conch cement and uh, they will also today uh, this is now the bus uh, people are talking about bus this is one of the bus i told you that uh, we have uh, uh, here they were sub they will be there will be three of them that this place and also uh, and also this place uh. and we shall be also having here this one so it will have to be extended maybe somebody will be have to ask me why is it that they are short they will have to be extended and uh, the rings that has been used these are, are what we call rings that are uh, okay yeah the rectangular uh, rings and they are used uh, d8 and this one uh, d10 so it is a it is the stronger one and uh, we have also the back filling we have the back filling yesterday you could saw this uh this uh, this place was so deep hmm? So uh, we have, uh, I told you that we, should, we were having backfilling and uh, this one has already been backfilled so they started with hardcore, they backfilled it with some soil, they are again uh, uh, putting some hardcore that uh, will be arranged with uh, a rope according to the line. Uh, according to the level of the trench after it has been arranged they will now uh, backfill it uh, with more arms uh, yeah with more arms so we shall also having to uh, we shall uh, i'm looking for the guys who will start uh, by tomorrow digging the septic tank so that uh, we can be able to get the more arms. instead of buying it we just uh, uh, dig the septic then we find the more arms. that one will start tomorrow because uh, there is a guy here say that he has a connection with the guys well, he has a connection with those one who who does that work Okay, so this is what we call Mora. What you are seeing here uh, is now Mora, and uh, it has already been. Uh, so the whole of the uh, the whole of the building uh, should look like this this place the way it is. Uh. So from here, that means that after they have put the Mora, uh, both places we shall be they shall be now uh, putting the slab. When I say the slab, I mean the concrete. So we shall be having the concrete that. Uh, uh, we'll start from this side, all of this side, uh, going to going up to this side. Yeah. So you can see even this place. Huh? This place now is the one that uh, they want to put the the stones that are uh, has uh, uh, they have brought right now. And uh, also we have the they have backfilled some soil. Yeah. So people have already come from, uh, the, uh, the workers have already come from uh, lunch. We have others who go home, those ones who come uh, from around, we allowed them to be going home because they, uh, they suggested that. But uh, somebody who comes from far, we didn't allow him to be going back to, to be going for lunch because uh, he'll, get, uh, he'll be uh, using a lot of time. So this place, they are now dealing with this place. So today we want to make sure that at least we are finished with the uh, the backfilling so that tomorrow we shall be having what we call compacting. They shall be compacting using the, the stambas. We have one of the stamba there and uh, I shall be organizing with for the moram as I have said that uh, they shall be digging tomorrow the septic. So the engineer will be showing us where they will uh, be digging the septic uh, today so that tomorrow when they, they come, the diggers come, they find a place whereby they can be able to dig the septic and uh, find the moram. Okay, so engineer, uh, we want you to you okay. You will be able to show us later uh, the place whereby will be they will be digging the septic so that uh, the moram your moram in Isaac at Saidia. Eh, it's a poor around up. Eh, ni pipe tu. Septic hata kiweza kuwa tu huko mbali ni pipe. Sasa kitu tunaweza fanya tunaweza amua tuisongesha karibu na ile choo. Ni kalio kwa maana hiyo choo tunaweza amua tuje tu tu backfill turudishe mchanga ndani kisha ujenzi kisha. Sasa tujenge septic chimbo hapo kubwa. 
sasa hiyo size tena size wa endo tatu advice size ya kuchimba na nilikuwa na nani kuna mwenye ametuambia siju watu wanatoka mabe huyo mm. anasema kwa wenye wanajua kuchimba sasa watakuja nitamwambiaje nao kesho na waanze kuchimba ndio sasa tupate hiyo moram nataka ikizekana kesho wakati hiyo nini natoka hiyo moram wanatoa inasambazwa hapa boy alikuwa hapa nakutafuta na boy eh boy yupi kuna chacha Mm, labda ni labda kuna mchanga. Alikuwa anasema anataka chimi ya nani. Sijajua sasa. Sasa unaona wale washawai. Okay, so we have also the form work that is going on right now. Uh, and uh, is being led by Jose the Mason here. Yeah. And uh, maybe has to greet us a bit. He tell us if yeah. what uh, what uh, how the work is. Uh? Yeah, the work is on going well. Yeah. Yeah. We are now forming the, the form work, huh? form work the timber in yeah. order to report the concrete. The concrete inside. Yeah. Yeah. We, are, we, are already so, we, are, we are done already with the, the beam. Huh? Yeah, as you can see we are busy. Uh, you yeah. are busy, I can see you are busy. <laughs> if you are busy, don't speak. Yeah. And uh, what I respect is that uh, when you are busy, don't even take a video. Take a video after you have finished the work. Yeah. Yeah. That's how it's supposed to be. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys, uh, uh, this is now the form work that uh, uh, they are doing. We have this one that you are seeing here, it will be used like a bottom, they call it bottom, yeah. uh, to hold a concrete on uh, openings of the windows. Uh. Yeah. And uh, we have also, they, they are using some materials like binding wire, we have the nails, and uh, this one are called the, okay, we have the rubbers, they are used to, uh, to join, they are used to join uh, the sides of uh, timber and this side's timber. And we have the supporter here, it has supported this timber that has been uh, already uh, kept there. And uh, the, the nails has already have already been driven inside, and uh, also this part we shall be having a bottom to hold the uh, the concrete. So he's remaining with this part uh, to finish uh, with the forms. Then uh, they mix the concrete, they pour the concrete. So just continue following us, guys. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, and uh, maybe I shall be also be heading to. Uh, I shall be heading to Kangariso after this video so that uh, uh, oh, in the next video uh, I want to go and uh, speak to Mama Maria Mama Maria and uh, also uh, to see how we can set their project and when I say that to set their project I mean that uh, somebody was asking me that uh, how can you manage uh, 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 two projects or three projects I want to tell him that uh, I can ma you can manage even 10 projects. You can manage even 10 projects. If you are, you are you are serious, you can manage even 10 projects. That's why you can find an engineer. An engineer can have be having 10 contracts, but uh, you find that the old contract that he's having has been finished. So what I will do, I have the team. I have Otenga, I have Zach Discoveries. So when even if, if that uh, project will, uh, will go on, they shall be there because that's why I have them. They shall be there and that project and... Uh, uh, because the subscribers are willing to help, they shall be there running the projects and me, I shall be here and also they shall be also here be helping me uh, with some places. So we are here and uh, we are just came to uh, to see how the work is going on. If you see very well, the concrete has already been started being used. Huh? They have already started using concrete. So this concrete is the one that uh, uh, will, be, uh, will help us to mix the... Uh, uh, the the concrete now. So okay, that one is a I can put here. That one is called a gravel. So these are the gravels. So the gravels are being transported from the uh, using the wheelbarrow, uh, coming to the site so that they can be able to finish this part. So after they have finished this part, uh, we shall be having an adjustment process uh, before we before we do roofing. And uh, we have here how they are preparing a beam. This is called a beam. And uh, they are using some of the aggregate reinforcement materials. When I say reinforcement materials, we have the beaten and uh, we have the ring. So we are led by engineer. Engineer who? Evans Mirama. Ev Evans Mirama. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is also a professional mason. So don't don't look uh, don't look him that way. You, uh, he has also papers. He has also papers. He can prove you with the papers. So he's mixing. This one is called D8, R6, yeah? yeah. And this one are D8. D8. Uh, this one is D10. D10. Yeah. Wow. So this house will be strong. It will be very strong. Okay. 
So the stores that has arrived right now, they have already started uh, transporting it to the site. And uh, these are what we call rings. Rectangular ring. See how it looks like. So it has made, from there we find something we call a beam. So this is a beam. I don't know if I'm wrong, if somebody's watching and is uh, an engineer, you can correct me where I went wrong. You learn from mistake. This one is called an axle for cutting metals. Axle. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so I feel like I can check. I don't know if there is a water here. But I cannot take water that I don't know. I can't take any water. No, this one I'm not taking it. So I want to go uh, up to up to where we store materials. There's something I want to go and confirm there. As a project manager, I've also, as a project manager, I've also to be walking and see there how many bags of cement have remained, uh, any materials that is remained there, so that I can be able to. Uh, to have that summer eh? it will help me a lot yeah so let me use this this rod yeah so that's the site from far you can see from far and this is the work of Pamela and Rabosco, the work of joint hand, green life tree. This is their work. So wherever they are, they are watching the video. We are proud of you. Yeah. We are proud of you. Oh, we have this one. Somebody said that uh, uh, this one are called husk. Husk. <laughs> I never knew even the name. I never knew that's how they call it. So they call it husk. Yeah, this is how we call it. Eh? We have here some cones. This one are almost to be harvested. They are almost to be harvested. There is funeral going on somewhere. Uh, uh, Mama Winnie, foster mother. So it is up there. You can hear the music. Yeah. We have the music there. Mara, Mara, Banyaji. I'm fine. Kopoa. Eh? Yeah. So I have to confirm something here. Oh, it is this house. Huh? Yeah. So I've confirmed. We have one wheelbarrow here. We have one wheelbarrow. We have one iron sheet. That uh, uh, have not been used. And uh, we have some bags of cement. Yeah, yeah. So how many are they? One, two, three, four of them. And we have there that iron sheet, half of iron sheet that remained. Wow. Okay, so thank you guys. Uh, I'm ending the video uh, from here. And uh, please don't miss to join me in the next video because... Uh, uh, I will be going to go and visit Mama Mama uh, Maria. So thank you guys and uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye bye. I don't want a copyright. There's a song. There's a radio there. Bye bye.